Hey, hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. I know that I look a little weird, but don't mind that. I will look all put together by the end of this video, I swear. So I wanted to do a uh, video on this I like right here. It's like a green to like blue shimmer smoky eye. I think it looks really cute and it looks really fun. So I hope you guys enjoy um, my little tutorial on how to get this look right here. So let's hop right into it. Okay, so I angled you guys a little bit more up so you could kind of see my eye better and I have kind of moved in a bit more. I just really want to highlight this area of my face. I know the rest of me doesn't look very good right now, but we're not, we're not focused on that part. So for the first thing I'm going to do is take this. It's like a little cream eyeshadow. It's a, a Kylie Jenner one. It was a limited edition one. This is literally the third time I've used this product. Um, it is, it's, it's pretty good. I like it. It is it's very pigmented um if you like use your finger but like using a brush like this adds allows you to like add a little bit of color at a time which I really like and so I'm really gonna be focusing that into my crease and blowing it out because it is acting as my transition color so i really want to make sure it is blended and if you guys want to see a little swatch of what the color looks like it is right here this is a swatch i did earlier um as you can see i've been playing with stuff on the back of my hand i like i was like holding this up to like to use a mirror but that is definitely not a mirror, so that was weird. Just keep blending that color out until you have hit your desired blend. When you're done, it should look a little something like this. So I'm gonna be taking this color emerald right here, which is a green color, and placing that right on my outer V. And just blending that in. And also, I'm going to be taking it in my crease as well. Blending it out into that green color that I applied earlier. I know that this isn't exactly the best angle. And I am sorry about that. I will definitely get better at at my angles and such as this journey continues next i'm going to be taking oh where is it i'm going to be taking this color right here it is merry mint it's kind of like a very like pale light blue sort of color and i'm going to be packing that all over my lid is just kind of like a flat brush it is a little more angled you can just use any kind of flat brush to apply your shadow and you're going to be just applying that as such and then also you're gonna to want to go back in with that green brush and make sure to blend and just make sure that it's a seamless blend together and where the light blue and that dark green kind of meet like so now it is time for the shimmer so i'm going to be using some nyx glitter primer that i've already applied to the back of my hand and then I'm just using a very small, flat little brush by Wet n Wild. And I'm taking the primer onto the brush and then putting it onto my lid right over where I applied that blue color. And then I am going to be taking this color right here, which is Jingle, which is kind of just like a overlay of shimmer. And then I am going to be 
applying that with my finger. For a blinding glow. Don't you know? Also, I don't know if it's just me, but every time I hear the phrase, don't you know, I just think of the anime wedding page. Because there's that little demon in there that says, don't you know, all the time. Wedding Peach is an anime. Oh, it's good as food. I liked it. So, yeah. Okay, so now I am just going to be going back into the green color with that same brush. And dragging it along my little lash line. Then also make sure to connect it with your shadow that was applied on the upper region as well. I'm going back in with the other brush in that emerald color and also applying it to my little lash line but varying very more specific and closer to the lash line. And now I'm just going to take a little fluffy brush and just dust away the shimmer that kind of got underneath all my base makeup. So, and then I'm going to be taking the color Snowball, which is this white color, on an angle brush and just using that to highlight my inner corner. And then I'm also going to mix in a little bit of Jingle as well, which is that color that we used on the lid. Just to add a little bit more shimmer to the white. And then now all I need is some mascara. So I'm going to be using the, vol the Voluminous Lash Paradise Waterproof Mascara. And I'm just going to be adding that to my lashes. Hey guys, so this is the final look. I am done with everything. I hope you enjoyed this little eye tutorial. If you're wondering what I'm wearing on my lips, it is this. It is the Romeo London 16 Hour Provoca Lips in the shade Heartbreaker. So yeah, it kind of matches, well, it matches my sweater better in person than on camera, but that's the kind of vibe. I was going for when I went for this lip color show. I feel like it goes pretty well with this look. I'm happy with it. So that's all that really matters. Um, also, uh, I didn't add the shiny side, which is why it looks a lot more matte than it did if I add the shiny side. If you want to see how I got the base, go check out my other video. I will try to have everything listed in the description box below. If I don't, I am sorry. But I will see you guys in my next video. Until then, bye!